Good morning guys, it is October day four and we are all ready for church. The kids are getting loaded in the car and the chili is going. Looks and smells so good. So we are gonna go head out. I'm gonna grab myself something to eat because I do not have time to make myself something to eat. Um, so yeah, we will see you when we get back from church. We are back from church and I ran into the commissary real quick to get eggs and stuff. A couple other things I'll show you real quick. Picked up two dozen. I found these I think would be fun to do with the boys. Some baby food for Ivy. Needed some more tomatoes for that tomato soup. And then a couple of these things were canceled for my Aldi order for meals, so I had to get that. And then we've got the chili right here. And it smells so good. I changed out of my church clothes and I'm getting ready to tidy up the kitchen, wash all these lunch dishes and the boys and I made little pumpkin cookies that they thought were so much fun. And Taylor's putting Noble down for a nap. The chili was so good, especially with those pumpkin tortilla chips from Trader Joe's. It's like really perfect for that, honestly. So good. And there's some leftovers, so I think Taylor may take that for dinner for um, work tonight because he's working another swing shift. And I think after I get all this tidied, I um, am gonna make a coffee, maybe read my book. I need to look at my planner and see what's on the agenda for the next couple days. <clears throat> and uh, maybe do some laundry, but we'll see. I think today's just gonna kind of be a more relaxed, chill day. Okay, so the boys are awake and so is Ivy and Taylor just left for work. So I'm making the boys a little snack. This is what I am just whipped up for them. Some yogurt and some granola. So that's gonna be their little after nap snack. I think I'm gonna put together a little simmer pot on the stove because I have some fresh rosemary. I have some lemons and I've got some cinnamon sticks, vanilla extract. So I think I'm gonna whip something up together. I think it'll smell really good. So I have these two. This one's more fresh, but this one is in, it's kind of going bad. It got freezer burn. So I'm going to use the greener ones and I just put some water in there. So I'll just do that. And I think I'm going to do the Williams Sonoma simmer pot, which is rosemary, vanilla, and lemon. And I think I have a very old YouTube video on my channel of how I made it. Um, it's kind of cringe worthy, but I've got a lemon here and then I think I've got just some vanilla. Okay, so I just did a whole lemon and then quite a few sprigs of that rosemary that was going bad and then a splash of vanilla extract. And then I'm just simmering. So I think I'm going to go upstairs and grab the boys sheets because I really need to wash their sheets and quilts. So I think I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna Put away the dishes that I washed earlier. The boys are watching a cartoon. So it's just kind of a chill, relaxed evening while Taylor's at work. And for dinner, I don't really know what I'm gonna do yet. <laughs> I will probably look in the pantry, maybe we'll do sandwiches and some chips or something. Something simple. 
Okay, so let's open these up. <laughs> You guys are wondering where their sheets and stuff are from. All of it is from Target. I don't usually shop at Target, but that's where I bought these originally. And Noble has the Dalmatians. And then he said he took a nap in his closet. <laughs> that's like the cutest thing. <laughs> and I guess he did. And then his quilt is also from Target. So grab this real quick. He's got the green quilt and then dinosaur sheets. And these are like really affordable and really um, like soft too. Okay, gonna go throw all of these. Okay, gonna go throw all these in the washer. Get these washed before bedtime. So the sheets are in. Mark that off my to-do list. I've had that on my to-do list for a while. And then after those get done, I will put in the quilts. So now I'm gonna go ahead and put these away. So tomorrow is the day that I'm going to do the whole house declutter with you guys and I'm really excited because there's a lot of stuff I see in this one particular cabinet and I'm like tempted to just like pull it out and put it in a box but I'm gonna wait for you guys and take you guys along with me because I love decluttering content and I know YouTube does too. <laughs> so uh, I am excited about that and if you guys want to declutter along with me a couple things I like to do before I declutter is find like an empty diaper box or a brown paper sack or get a trash bag, whatever, and have those with me. And you can get a trash sack for throwing trash away or you could use that for decluttering either way. I usually like to have both a box and a trash sack. That way I can throw out trash and then I can take a box and then just go throughout each room of the house and put in that box what I know I don't want. And then usually once that box is full, I'll put it in my car or my trunk. And that way next time we're out running errands, I can drop it off at the donation center and it's out of my house. And I no longer have to think about it or like clean around it or worry about it. So on and so forth and just gets out of my house really quickly. I think that's a pretty popular decluttering rule of just maintaining your stuff and like managing it. It's just get, out, get all the decluttering stuff out of your house. So. I just opened the window and it's so pretty outside. The fall weather in Illinois is my favorite. It's so pretty. So the boys are still eating their snack. Ivy's in the living room playing with a package of YBs. It's third child for you. <laughs> I really don't know why I have baby toys. I really don't because she'll play with a diaper for hours on end. She'll play with YBs, um, measuring spoons. Like babies really truly don't need toys, you guys. That is a fact. So the simmer pot is going. It smells so good. It smells like William Sonoma in here. The, you went potty? So uh, I think we're gonna play outside pretty soon. I'm just gonna go sit out there with them. If I stay inside, they usually don't play outside very well. And I would like to at least play out there for maybe an hour or an hour and a half before dinner time. I'm gonna turn the TV off pretty soon. And uh, 
I usually like to take my planner or my notebook outside and just work through it and look through it and plan meals and stuff. So I may do that while they play outside. What are they? It could be like it. I had to throw my hair up because I got really hot. <laughs> we were outside for a little bit. It warmed up. I think it's about, like around 78 degrees. I'm currently eating some dinner. The boys are eating their dinner. And I just switched over the sheets. So the sheets are in the dryer. Quilts are all in the washer. And played outside for a little bit. So I think we're just going to chill out for the next hour or so. Get ready for bed bedtime and then I'm gonna work on editing this video and uh, getting everything ready for tomorrow for decluttering which I'm so excited about so I'm gonna eat dinner and then I'll pick you guys back up later hey guys I got the sheets dry so I'm gonna go ahead and make beds the quilts are in the dryer uh, but deal's gonna go to bed soon so here's Noble's bed but I need to go do fields in just a second so. going to get my PJs on, wash my face, and start editing this video. I also need to finish um, uploading tomorrow's, or for you guys, it's yesterday's video. <laughs> um, I need to get that up. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed Vlogtober day four. This was definitely a shorter vlog and probably because it was more chill and it's Sunday. So we don't have a whole lot going on, but tomorrow Taylor is off and uh, we're gonna do the whole house declutter and I'm really excited about that. I think he's gotta work on his truck. He got a starter in the mail because I guess his truck um, doesn't wanna start. He's probably going to um, try and put the starter in or look at it and see what he can do to it. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I think Tuesday, I am getting my hair cut. I'm getting it trimmed and probably thinned out because it's getting really thick. And I do need to probably pick up some paint to start painting our bedroom. So I think that's what I'm gonna do because I think I'm gonna start painting our bedroom this weekend so I can get that knocked out. Um, and then all that will be left to paint is the entire downstairs. So, Anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I hope you guys will keep watching and stick with me <laughs> throughout this vlogtober. I'm not used to doing vlog vlogs, so it's kind of new for me. But anyway, I will see you tomorrow for vlogtober day five.